On today's episode, is it worth the cash or should you keep looking? Anthony unboxes and reviews Logitech's G930 wireless headset. This episode is brought to you by XSplit, powering countless HD live streams and recordings around the world. Thank you so much. Today I wanted to talk to you about this. This is the Logitech G930. It's a wireless headset that has three programmable G keys on the left ear. It also has a nice volume slider that allows you to control the volume at your whim so you don't have to fumble around with the volume control on some cord or anything like that. You also don't have to go mucking about in your PC settings just to control the volume, which is nice, especially in-game when you're in the heat of battle playing something like, I don't know, League of Legends. It's really nice to have. Also, I've found when it comes to flight simulator games, having controls here, for some reason, really works. I like it. The microphone has a really interesting feature where if you flip it up, it mutes the microphone. The headset is quite noisy, to be honest with you. And I'm not talking about the sound that it produces. The sound it produces is actually pretty darn good. However, when you jostle it around, whether it's on your head or in your hands, it does make a little bit of noise. I it's something you get used to, but it's definitely a gripe that I have. The thing does pack flat. Oh, look how awesome that is. You can pack this away in a suitcase or a travel bag, whatever you want to do, and it'll make the trip. One of the things that I do not like about it is when you do pack it flat, it's not quite flat. As you can see, there's kind of a curvature to it. So, eh, I don't know. It's one of those things, again, you get used to. You will learn to work around the product. But in the end, it's always best when products work around us, not the other way around. One of the problems that I have with this headset is the wireless connectivity. I've got new neighbors downstairs and some kind of something that they have interferes with the wireless signal that this shares with its pairing unit. Now, it's not that huge of a deal, but ever so often, I do have to unplug it, plug it back in, which has actually forced me to use my Gomdius headset more often than I normally would. I really like the styling. I really, really like the colors. You can't go wrong with black and red. It's awesome. The battery life on these is about four hours, which is okay, I guess, except for it doesn't automatically shut off when you're not using it. So if you set it down and walk away, you can come back to a dead headset, which again forces me back to using my Gomdius headset while these get an initial charge. Yeah, I don't know. I also previously had a headset from Performance Design Products, or PDP, known as the Afterglow headset. This headset was actually a little bit better about handling battery life, and I got about six hours or so uh, out of actual use, which was really nice. I'm the kind of guy, I spend a lot of time at the PC, I spend a lot of time with headphones on, and for me, I've actually made the decision, I don't think wireless is for me. On a scale of one to 10, I give this thing probably about a seven. Now that is an arbitrary number that I pulled out of my rear end, but taking into consideration the number of pluses and minuses, that's about what I think it really should be. If you think that I should give these away as part of a gear locker sponsorship, let us know in the comment section down below and I'll see if I can make it happen. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any experience with this product or any products like it, let us know in the comment section down below. I'd love to have a discussion about it. Also. Don't forget to give this video a like, maybe share it out to your friends, maybe share it out to your enemies, again, and again, and again. But hey, that's up to you. Hit us up on Twitter, at ImpulseThis, and I can always be fine in the description down below at youtube.com slash Anthony Smith. Freedom heart! Wait, is that a heart? I don't know. Freedom heart! Today I wanted to talk to you about the Game DS, um, Gom DS, um, the Herfreti- Why do they always give me the ones I can't pronounce? Regardless of how you pronounce it, this headset is a strong contender for the best headset I've actually ever put on my head. It's very comfortable, in fact, it's really easy to forget that you even have on. In fact, right now- Right now, I forgot I'm not even wearing it. Secrets, if you really look at yourself, you will be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, kids more worried.